South by Southwest is, is recognized universally as uh, sort of the mothership of the music industry once a year in March in Austin. And if we could get Vermont to represent itself there in, uh, in a cohesive way that brings attention to um, the variety and the talent of the musicians that come from our state, then we'd have a chance at uh, positioning them for, for um, a leg up. We're really excited to work uh, on the South by Southwest project to bring Vermont musicians and performers to a really large national scale uh, so that we can share that story about what makes Vermont so unique and so interesting. The party's in Austin and if we can get uh, you know, if we can get a crew down there to really turn the noise up and get some attention, it would be good for everybody in Vermont. Well, Big Heavy World has a, a real core philosophy of inclusivity. Uh, we, we make a very purposeful effort to support musicians from Vermont um, at every level of their development and in every genre. And so that, in, that was sort of underlying our, our protocol for the selection process. Uh, South by Southwest uh, provided us um, a roster of artists that, um, that had applied to South by. And we uh, formed a, a panel of people attached to music or marketing from across the state. Um, it was a a mix of genders and musical experiences and that panel uh, considered the artists that were qualified to be considered and generated a lineup that they felt um, was a fair representation of music from across Vermont. Forget about the snow, forget about the cold for one day. You're not getting... This came about uh, in the last year um, as the, we were looking at funding options for all the bands that we potentially wanted to send to South by Southwest in March. It's not a cheap endeavor. Not that these bands aren't successful, but uh, they could probably use a little help in terms of accommodation and expenses. We all put our heads together and we came up with this wonderful idea to do a Vermont Music Showcase to help raise money uh, for the bands so they have an avenue of uh, financial support to be able to get down to South by Southwest, get their names known, and hopefully um, get a contract, get distribution. Uh, as we all know in Vermont, um, being a local band can be really tough. RETN really looks at music and the arts as an integral part of education. And we're always looking for innovative community projects. So when the partnership opportunity came up here with uh, Big Heavy World and Main Street Landing, two people we've done a lot of music projects with before, and to benefit Vermont musicians, we thought, well, that's a perfect winter project for us. Really, the opportunity to support musicians who are going to Austin is a big part of why we wanted to get on board and do all the video for this. So what you're seeing tonight uh, on, on television or hearing on the radio or seeing on a stream all across Vermont is a result of a lot of organizations truly investing what they have to offer um, in, in supporting Vermont's music scene. and. It's, uh, you know, we live in a state where we can accomplish something like this, which is very special. And I think, you know, when you think about it, it's, it's worth reflecting on and, and, and coming to understand. You know, Vermont is a, a unique place where people collaborate to make bigger, better things happen. And this is evidence of that.